to Africa princess welcome back to my channel today I want to share with you my sweet potato experience like I don't know why I'm laughing I'm sure I'm laughing because when I first heard of it it was so funny it's like everything from the kitchen is ending up nowadays in the white hair like from rice to onion to carrot to whatever and then now they say sweet potatoes like it's so funny it's so weird so I was like very skeptical but then I said let me just look it up i look on google and it's actually talking about um it's mostly beneficial when you like consume it it's like good for the skin and the hair and all that but then i also found an article that explains how um beneficial it is when you apply it directly on your hair so they said it straightens the hair and it softens it and etc etc so i said all right let me give it a try and then I did that I baked my potato which you must not only bake you can still roast it or grill it and then I blended it with olive oil they actually said you could put olive oil coconut oil um, egg and all those things but I think okay then what would be the difference between that one and your normal homemade dipping conditioner that you use banana pay and all those things so to actually know if it's um, olive um, no the sweet potato that is working you should avoid all those other things and maybe just one oil so i did the olive oil and the sweet potato and everything and then i applied on my hair so at that point i was thinking like okay no it's not gonna work like sorry sweet potatoes you're yummy my tummy and all but my hair is not gonna have a relationship with you like i'm not sure but then i uh, applied it on my hair Satin, uh, no, my plastic bag and then a beanie cap on top of it, and I let it sit for just 30 minutes. 30 minutes, and that was it. So I took it out, and then I felt it, it was like okay, she was not like soft, 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 but it was soft enough. And then I rinsed it out, but don't expect it to come out at the first rinse, like that's the down part of this thing it doesn't like wash out when you just rinse it you need to use a conditioner to wash it out to be clean i washed it and then i came out and then i touched my hair that's when i felt the difference like the hair was soft in a different way like it's a different kind of softness you feel like your hair becomes like baby soft like you just feel i don't know how to explain it but your hair becomes soft that one is for sure 100 percent i felt a difference and then i went on to do my twist as usual normally when i do my twist from the back coming to the front i have to spray more water because it gets dry before i get to the front right right i started doing my twist and then I came to this section and it did not need me to spray any more water which means it had retained moisture than it would normally do and I was like okay this is so weird like in a good way and then I did it to the end and then this section is a, um, the strongest part of my hair or the hardest part of my hair and the most dry part of my hair which I always spray water when I get to this section I came to this section and it was still soft like I was like oh my god this is so soft like it was soft really soft and good so I was so very happy with this whole process and conditioning issue the deep conditioning process with the sweet potato was a success but don't expect it to be like um, uh, um, like a detangler like when you put some deep conditioning 
deep conditioners in you can like detangle your hair no it's not that kind of softness it doesn't give sleep that's the word i'm trying to look for it doesn't give sleep but it gives you that softness that i can guarantee you so it was a good experience i think i'll do it again the only thing is it's more a little bit more difficult to rinse out than your normal uh, deep conditioner you use but Come on, it's very cheap, it's affordable, it's accessible, it's like in your face everywhere, so why not? So I think I will do it again. I will actually leave it on next time for longer and really see the magic it will, um, the magic that's behind this. And I'm excited to take out this twist beneath this um, scarf to see how my twist out is going to look like, if there's going to be a difference or not. And then another weird thing, like after applying and when I did everything, and now I was done washing and everything, my palm, it was like weirdly very soft and smooth. I kept doing like this because it was so soft. So I don't know if sweet potatoes also works for the skin or something like physically when you apply it, like I really want to try something. I want to do this same mask and then just dip my feet in it to sit for like 30 minutes and then I'll wash them and I'll see if there will be a difference or something because up to now i washed my hair yesterday but today i still feel some slip on my palm which is like unusual like really soft so there is something about this sweet potato which i'm gonna experiment even more my sweet potato experience i think that's all uh, you need to know that's all i have for you concerning this topic sweet potato topic so i hope you like this video like subscribe comment anything and then see you in my next video thank you so much for watching bye